Rachel Riley gives intimate insight into relationship with Strictly's Pasha Kovalev. The duo met when they danced together on Strictly's 2013 series, in which they were eliminated fifth. Rachel rarely speaks about her relationship in public, instead letting her insane number skills take the spotlight. But on today's episode she lets slip a little detail that people all around the country might be able to sympathize with. Loved up, Rachel Riley spoke about her boyfriend Pasha Kovalev. Going strong, Rachel met Pasha when they danced together on Strictly. Rachel Riley host Nick Hewer was discussing the new pound coin and how the old one will soon be unusable. Rachel said she hadn't been saving coins, but revealed, I don't have a drawer of coins but Pasha, I don't know if it's a man thing, you suddenly leave a pile of coins everywhere. Whether it's just him? Women keep them in their purse, so they get rid of them all the time. We've had half a cupboard of his coins. It's very strange. She has previously opened up about her and Basha's differences, admitting that it works quite well. It as a man thing, Rachel wondered why Pasha left piles of coins everywhere. The 31-year-old told Daily Star Online, from personal experience if I had seen on paper, Russian ballroom dancer, considering myself, Essex maths girl who likes football, I never would have thought that we were compatible. But my other half and I get on brilliantly because of our personalities and viewpoints. Despite their relationship working well, it seems she and Pasha won't be making it official anytime soon. I am in love now. I don't feel I have to get married, she told the Daily Express. I don't think I need that pressure anymore. And I am perfectly happy. Curse? Rachel and her husband split shortly after her strictly stint. Rachel has been married before, to her university love Jamie Gilbert. Though they separated in November 2013. At the time, it was suggested that Rachel had fallen victim to the so called Strictly curse. Countdown airs weekdays at 2.10 pm on Channel 4.